As entrepreneurs grow their businesses and start building teams, it's important to build the right model with the right people and correct policies in place. Startups that survive the litmus test of the first 1,000 days of operation face a new set of challenges as they face the conundrum of when and how to build the right team that will help the business to leapfrog from a one-man show to an established corporation. The next installment of the I Am An Entrepreneur Summit will be hosted under the theme Building Teams. For more, we're joined by Guy Dumetzelikaba, who is the MD and Head of Enterprise and Supplier Development of I Am An Entrepreneur. Guy Dumetzi, thank you so much for your time. Um, you know, I mean, I just gave a brief uh, intro in terms of the importance of building teams, but talk to me about uh, what inspired you and your team to decide to focus on uh, building teams this time around. So, um, good afternoon and thank you for having me on your show. Um, so this time around, we really wanted to help entrepreneurs because the apex of our company, I'm an entrepreneur, is to help businesses um, build and grow um, their, their, their businesses. So what we really wanted to do is focus on what is it that entrepreneurs get wrong and the challenges that entrepreneurs face when moving from a one-man show and trying to build a, a company and start building teams. So we're really trying to help them in that aspect. And really what we are focusing on um, this time around is three things, um, I would say. And that's when is it the right time to build um, a team in your business, the common mistakes and challenges that entrepreneurs make when they are building their teams, and also some of the best practices um, that can be built into their businesses to enable them to build um, sustainable and, and effective teams. And we have like wonderful guest entrepreneurs on our show and our summits tomorrow that are going to share their insights and also what helped them to build effective and productive teams in their businesses. Right. When it comes to, uh, you know, getting your team ready, I mean, from some of the entrepreneurs you've spoken to who are lined up for tomorrow, what are they saying? Like, what are the qualities should you be looking for, for in terms of uh, people that you can trust uh, to take your vision forward? I think the biggest thing that's come up about building teams is, one, getting the right people to, to be able to build with you. Um, because you also have to get people that are really vested in the dream and vested in growing the business um, with, with you as the, as the entrepreneur. Secondly, you really want to put your team forward for success. So um, on the one leg, it's about getting the right people, but on the other leg, it's about having the right resources to enable the teams that you're building to actually succeed in growing your business. So people are, we're really looking forward to, to our guests. I mean, just to mention a few, we have um, Mate Mudise, the founder of Beauty on Tap. We have Joy Mongala, the Blue Bulls defense um, coach, no one better to tell us about teams than him. We have Ian Fur, we have Mpumi Liduaba, we have Dendai, uh, very popularly known as Beast, Mdawarira, um, that is a past Springbok um, team player, as well as an entrepreneur now. And we have some good insights as well from FNB that are going to help us in terms of staying compliant in building your teams and just putting together the right processes in your business to have um, teams running effectively and efficiently and helping you as an entrepreneur build and grow your business. What has been the reception of uh, I am an entrepreneur, especially from uh, other entrepreneurs who may have felt like they're not really part of the conversation? Since the launch of I am an entrepreneur, what kind of reception are you getting from others out there? We're really getting some good feedback. Um, entrepreneurs, we really, I mean, our platform is really there to help entrepreneurs learn and to help entrepreneurs become better and upskill entrepreneurs in skills um, that are required in building businesses and building sustainable businesses. And even though um, it might, you might not be building a team tomorrow, or even though you might not be building a team next week or even next month, but the lessons that you learn now are lessons that you can implement in your business six months from now, a year from now. So the lessons that come out of the summits really entrepreneurs receive very, very well. And I think one of the biggest things that is big on our summit is that when entrepreneurs do log on, we on a data free stream. Um, so entrepreneurs can register and watch for free without using their own data. I am an, entre I am an entrepreneur sponsors the data that the entrepreneurs use to watch the summit. So the learning out of it has, be has been very, very positive. And after they've from um, our previous summits, um, you know, the, the feedback and the implementation of what they've learned in the summit has been great. Mm -hmm.
On that note then, before I let you go, after the summit, uh, after the entrepreneurs learn what they need to learn, how do you then go from learning to then actionable stuff to implement? Uh, is there a networking that they could do with the speakers? Um, absolutely. They can come through us as I'm an entrepreneur if they do have any additional questions or they have some implementation questions that they'd like to give to the speakers, uh, a particular speaker, they can come to us through either our website, they can email us on info at imanentrepreneur.co.za, um, they can go on our website www.imanentrepreneur.co.za, which is the same website that they can um, register for the summit that's happening tomorrow um, between 10 and 11.30 in the morning. And then they can also um, link through, through our socials. We are on an Instagram, we are on Twitter at IAAESA, we are also on Facebook. So if you just send us your messages, um, then we can, we can definitely help you with the implementation or challenges that you're experiencing when implementing the lessons learned um, during the summits. Keith Dumete, thank you so much for your time. That is uh, Keith Dumete Likaba, who is the MD of I'm an Entrepreneur.